Hey kiddos, time for the daily bread. We're marching our way to the end of Genesis and uh, Joseph and his brothers are marching their way to the land of Canaan with um, not just their family, but with the Egyptians as well. And uh, we'll pick up from there. Let's hear today's track. Daily track 887, Genesis chapter 50, verse nine through 10. Likewise, he had his company ch chariots and horsemen and it became a crowd without restraint. And they arrived at the threshing place of Atad, which is situated beyond the Jordan. There they spent seven full days celebrating the funeral rites with a great and vehement lamentation. Kids, so yesterday we talked about how there's quite a caravan here of people. Most of uh, Jacob's family went, except the little ones and, and uh, you know, some of the animals. But here we see that uh, the Egyptians also went and they brought their you know, horsemen and chariots and quite of a, a you know amount of people that were going and uh we also see that um they they made it to Atad which isn't you know all the way in the land of Canaan where they need to be it's close but um they ended up doing their funeral rites for 7 days they spent um you know grieving over uh, Jacob and um and just pre preparing for his, his burial. And so um, tomorrow we'll continue here and um, we'll, we'll see as we march through here the next couple of tracks, um, Jacob will be buried. And uh, you can see it's quite a process. Um, at this point, you know, we had the um, 40 days of uh, abomination or, uh, and uh, embalming of the body. And uh, then we had the 70 days of mourning, right? So there's been a lot of time that's passed since um, Jacob died. And uh, of course, now now with all the traveling time. Um, so this is uh, quite a, a process for the funeral. Um, very, very different than what we do today. God bless. I love you.